Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Endless Legends. I'm the Marmoset, and we are at war with the Pain Mages. Why? Well, because we've only managed to get ourselves quite a large province, but it's only the one province. And our plan is to send a settler out for here. We've already bribed the Delvers. These guys will become our allies if we complete this at the next economic plan, which should be coming up pretty soon. In that case, both the cities that we start off in this area and this area should get three extra pops to help off. So, planning to put a settler up this end, because we've got wine, sorry, dye and titanium up there. Planning to put a settler down here, because we've got titanium again, and more wine. So, leaning a slightly titanium heavy, but if I reckon if I pitch in around here, a couple of anomalies nearby to help there, several anomalies around here, and a watchtower in this area to help out here. So, they'll be quite far from our capital. This is a raw distance, but I'm pretty happy that um, those will be the best locations we can have to make real progress. Here's our moon pearls, are uh, Mark said, thusly on the map. Okay, right. Now, we are going to be attacking here, so let's see if we can get this flying unit. No, we can't get him that much closer. Let's uh, bring him as close as we can, just to get a little bit more vision. Let's bring the terrain back in. And we are going to our large amounts of move. One, two, three, four, and five. Good to get a chance to move up. I'll probably pick the pearl up on our next time, but let's move up on the city. So there's an enemy unit over there in the field. Five units guard in the city, so we are outnumbered slightly. What I intend to do is put the city under siege. Exploit the local resources, no longer limited. Each turn they lose fortification bonus. Four XP per turn, so basically they'll just put some damage on the fortification. You know, when the city's attacked, any of you defending it have this damage take first. Okay, yeah, so it's really in our interest to put the city under siege. Like so. And there's pretty much nothing else we can do this turn other than end it. And you are leaving. Okay. Not the choice I would have made. Let's go pick up a pearl and bring you to join the ski. Join the siege. Okay, so I've got reinforcements that have come from the city. I have my. Right, it's a. Uh, no. Okay, so this is the venture of the primary army. I've got my hero with my primary army. They've got. Right, so there is the hero, come back to life. Level 2 to my level 5. Some basic militia of the city. The orc. Okay, so I'm feeling pretty good about this. So let's... Ready to fight. Um, start offensive, since I want you lot to be charging. Okay, so I'm going to have units coming in as reinforcements. I believe later on, because this is the starting unit of the fight. It would be nice if I'd be able to do it with my other ally, but yeah, okay. You stay... This is how the fight started. Where can I put you then? Deployment. Not a lot of options. But I'll just have to take what I've got. Okay, so I think that's going to be it. So the rest of our units are going to come in as reinforcements, but also advantageously, the rest of the units are going to come in as reinforcements. So probably the best thing we can do is make sure we get our guys nice and safe. Okay, ready. Yep, some more of our units have come in. Who's this? Is that your hero? Yes, it is. How many hit points do you have? 
284. Got a lot of punch. Let's get some focus fire going. You're a ranged unit. Cavalry Slayer. What do you count as? Support. Speed 5. That's the hero. Only 140 hit points. Okay. Go here. Go here. And then attack. Put you on the other side of them. But they have to move around. Launch. Two points of damage. Hopefully, should get them out of the fight. Yep. Okay, so more of my reinforcements have arrived. You switch to hold position. Charge them down. Charge them down. Charge them down. Start working on that hero. Go. Okay. You apparently have an awful lot more punch than I thought you had. No. My hero is pretty devastating at the moment. Flying. A partial range strike. Okay, no damage. More of my reinforcements coming in. Go aggressive and strike. Let's just get the hero out of play for now. Okay. Suspect I might lose you. So I'm going to put you back on hold position. And just tell you to move. You attack that. So. Alright, let's run this series again. So you on there, you also on the hero. Hit that one, hit that one, hit that one, hit that one. You move to here. Launch. So the one out. Nice heavy amount of damage coming off our hero there. Uh, moving up, and then you get a big bonus from that ranged attack. Yeah, cavalry did a lot of damage there. It's their hero out. And we've got you, switch to hold position, and bug out. You move up, you move up. Everyone else appears to have decent targets. Let rip. So you're out of the way. Exchange of fire, charge bonus, getting stuck in. And there's a range strike from above. Ticking through, and there we go. Victory! All opposing troops have been destroyed. So I didn't lose anyone, I wiped them clean. Several units took a bit of a beating. Some Quite a bit of experience points across the board. Did you level up? Not quite, okay. But we are in a position now whereby I can attack the city. Yep, we took everyone out of it, so that city now belongs to us. It's rapidly doubling up our capability, so you're pacified. Fair enough. You've only won in this starting region, so you're not that of interest to me. So, did you take much in the way of damage at all? It's your health. 
Absolutely fine. In fact, you leveled up. Go and grab me that pearl. At least give me some more uh, information. Fair enough. There's you. How much movement have you got? A fair bit. Let's follow up that victory. Let's be quickly checking what we, the citizen, citizenry of this place are doing. So we're not losing quite as much money as we were, however. I right, want that to be holiday because you're in rebellion. So you are not going to be producing anything very much for me. Okay, fair enough. Right, what I almost need is, is cash. One for pacify villages. Minus 5.5. City improvements. Okay. Quite a fair bit of bits and pieces available. City Hall, Palace, Centre for Mineralogy. Okay, fine. Half the reason we've had with that. Pearls of Wisdom. Stop our science. Husbandry. Minor Village. Okay. Cancel that for now. Uh, you're in rebellion, so I suspect that you are going to be no. I don't want to do that. I suspect you're going to be in rebellion for a while, so I'm going to leave you be while I move up. Where's the next city's there? The hero's already dead. Let's move up and push our advantage. While we are ahead of time, we will take, we will do unpleasant things to them. You're out of action points. Okay. Detach the leader. Sleep. Auto explore. I'm just going to leave you there. I suspect you will provoke them to attack next turn. Can't quite get to there. End turn. Okay. I then will lose population next turn. One of your cities is idle. Fair enough. Okay, so I do need to make that positive. Can I do it with just one? I can. Right now you're neutral. Only losing 23 a turn. As the armies I've got is very expensive. You're all dedicated to production. If I put you all on there, I'm at plus one. So if I switch one across, minus three. See if I can just balance that out. Right, so four turns for that. I'm only moving minus 11. Hopefully, we will get some more useful things. That's pushing F turns that tile on. Useful. Right, so that was a turn. You. Yeah, okay, so that was just warning me that I had problems. I didn't do anything about that. It was nice of the game. Are you going to be dumb enough to try and attack me on this turn? Lust for Congress, return to the studies. Um, right, you're war exhausted because I just absolutely ragged on your army. That is just telling me that I should push my advantage. I am ready to fight. Right, you go there. Go there, go there. Uh, I am going to go completely before them. Okay, I am ready. So, you hold position, hold position, hold position. You strike that one. Everyone is on there. Yep. Nice starting amount of damage drawn by my hero there. 50 points to wipe them out. Everyone else should now charge in. Yeah, these guys have got Cavalry Slayer. So they do a damage against my units. Well, primarily Cavalry units, so... 
extra few points of experience points, didn't suffer much in the way of damage, no hero, done. Making their lives just that little bit more miserable. Temple Ruins, that's another pearl. I'll spot any more of the things. Oh, there's another one down there. I do want you moving up as an extra auxiliary spy unit. Give me just that little bit of extra vision. Let's move up on their city. Right. Would be advisable, I think, if I could park you in a city for a little bit. To heal. Transfer garrisons. Attach leader. And see to save the money for the retrofit. Okay. In that case, yeah, just stay there for now. That's a roving enemy band. Don't know. Alright, you're out of movement as well. But let's just back up just ever so slightly. Say, new empire plan. Okay, so according to our, according to our quest, none in ministry, one echo, one, one economy and one pop, one in economy and one in population. So, Empire plan. Okay, hang on a sec. Set for the following turns. Gained a level. Population is changed in one or more of your cities. Okay, yeah, that did actually go down. It did starve. Fair enough. But it's slowly but surely coming out of rebellion. You're on neutral, but you're happy. What was it I was looking for? Oh yeah, it was the Empire Plan. Edit the plan. Uh, okay, fair enough. So it was, according to the quest, set economy of population to its minimum level, don't put any influence in mili military. So, that, no evidence in military, so we'll just get plus three of that per city, which will help our cash thing quite a bit. Um, I'm not going to put any more in any of these, because I don't know what it's going to do or not, so I am just going to click Apply. Units, population has changed. Alright, I'll leave that done, and we'll see... <coughs> So it was you, wasn't it, who wanted to talk to us? Let's just end our turn in the city, because I'm endeavouring to heal. You're out of movements. Okay, so Ipidem isn't producing anything. City improvements. Plus one on city per rebuilt village. Okay. It's a district expansion. And the husbandry center. Plus one, lots of extra food. So, this would enable us to increase the territory of this city by quite a bit. So let's do that, and then queue up the husbandry center. You're neutral on food. You're neutral on food. Happy not to be growing, I just don't want to be... ...losing any at the moment. So that's all the warnings dealt with. Cycle the turn. Reliable ally. Pacified. Thank you. Reward pacification. Done. Action speed loudly. That was a relatively easy one to sort out. So we can now pop in, grab that pearl. Those two are far too close to that city. We've not gone anywhere else as far as I can tell. We'll leave you there just for now. Have you... Now, pretty sure you have healed.
I'm going to assume you have. Minimize. Hero. Okay, still making your way up the tree. You've got an extra extra space available. Interesting. Glory or death? Fortification, regional things, books, plus two science. It's a great steal, we don't can't do that. Okay, last resort. Proved movement. Proved damage. Just make you even more brutal. While well, we can, let's just get that applied. Spend a little cash, a vast amount of titanium. Let's have you come out to here. Very briefly. Okay. Do I need to be inside the zone? Oh yeah, I already talked to them about that, didn't I? There's a roaming army. Are you hostile? I'm out of move. Fine. Keep an eye on that and see if they how much they heal when they're not in a city. Oh, summer. Summer has returned. So just switching over. So we know it should be in a position. Yep, ready to fight. Yeah, I think some of them have healed. Let's get the all the weaker ones back and the stronger ones slightly forward. Happy with that deployment? No, if you wouldn't use a gun as two. Focus your attention. Uh, hold, hold, do nothing. Hold, attack, attack. 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 Twenty eight points of damage. Nice. Okay, you go for him. You also go for him. Everyone else just murderize. Dash, 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 dash. Strike from behind. 62 points of damage. These guys should come in and do quite a nice zero. Got him, at least. Three. A lot of maneuvering as people just gotta dash around. Trade some more blows. 81, nice hit. Cycle through. Wander around and gather up. Are you not quite leveled up yet, but other people have. Nine moves. Nice. You are pacified, but no one controls it. Couple turns into this. Your building. All right. So our ownership standard twenty percent. Twenty is up to twenty four percent. So it does take a while. But that looks like that. What it will be for this episode. Thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. This has been Endless Legends. I've been the Marmoset. Today we took the capital of our most hated enemy, the Pain Mages, and I think in a couple of episodes' time we will be looking at moving up and making their lives even more miserable uh, by pushing much further ahead. So um, I suspect there's not much in the city, but i got a few wounded units, so I'm going to spend at least a turn lurking. We are now making plus 49, um, because it's summer. Um, 
So yes, we don't quite need quite so much on the cache. So let's focus on getting that going. Red Ipanema. Um, can I have no one on cash? I can, and just let it trickle up so I'll get a little bit more production out of this one. There you go, growth, only 12. How many do I need on there to stay neutral? So I can just go full out production on here, get this moving a bit further forward. Alright, units leveled up. Another seeker, fair enough. Alright, thank you very much for watching, Edgeman. Please remember to like and subscribe.